Hello. So yeah, someone asked how I could do stack sizes to 2,000 for everything in Beacon. Uh, it's There's a couple ways to do that, I think. Uh, the, the easiest way offhand would be to do this. Hit new override, choose an item, uh, hit OK, then you can adjust the stack size here. Okay. Uh, then what you do is you highlight the item, and you're going to say duplicate. And then you can click one of the items and hit uh, Control A, and it'll highlight everything on the list. And then hit this double caret, and hit select. And now you've got 2,000 for everything. Obviously, uh, you may not want 2,000 for everything, so we can also do this a little bit more limited. Let's say we want only berries to be 2,000. So let's search for berry. Uh, say OK. 2,000. And we're going to say new override. And let's say that we decided, well, we did what we thought we wanted all the berries, but we want to make sure we don't have the seeds. So you could either try to filter out the seeds uh, with these uh, tag system, or you could do this. You could say you can highlight one, and you can hold c control, and you can just click on each berry, and it'll allow you to skip over items you don't want. Uh, alternatively, uh, not alternatively, but uh, you can also hold shift and it will highlight everything from the first item to the last item. And then you can even go back and hold control to unclick some of them if you want to. So that's our, that, that isn't necessarily beacon function so much as it is, uh, uh, you know, just a regular computer function. But uh, it is just uh, beacon is pretty good about implementing the uh, various different uh, keyboard and mouse shortcuts that exist on Windows and Mac uh, for proper use. That first time I didn't hit duplicate, I hit new override. So, uh, yeah, just uh, maybe that helps someone. I don't know. Take care.